Hello traders, Rich here and here is a quick but detailed update on Bitcoin. As usual, if you like video analysis, let me know in the comments or simply leave a like. So let's get started. As we clearly see, Bitcoin has been overall bullish, making higher lows and higher highs. However, as you clearly notice, we are experiencing a shift in momentum because the last impulse couldn't push higher as they were pushing before. For example, we had this big impulse followed by a 23.5 correction and an even bigger and steeper impulse followed by a smaller correction of 21 percent but last but not least we had this impulse movement which didn't push as much as the previous one followed by a bigger correction than the previous one so we are kind of now stuck inside a range i can no longer say that we are in a bullish trend because in this case we would have to see a bigger impulse a smaller correction like for example lower than 21 percent anyway you've got the idea we rejected the 30k zone which i have been highlighting for a while we traded lower and we even broke below the 27k support so now for the bulls to take over again from a medium term perspective we need to see a break above the 27k resistance zone the next support would be around 25k if broken downward it wouldn't be good would be breaking below this big range and we'll be expecting further bearish over the momentum will be shifted finally from bullish to bearish but for now we are stuck inside this range and it might be a continuation range it depends on how price reacts around the 25k if you zoom lower we had this big big wick that price is now filling so we might trade lower fill it before we trade higher so usually price fill 50 percent of it which is already done or sometimes like uh, like like more than 50 percent or even the entire wick so as long as we are here the bulls can still kick in unless it's broken downward below 24 300 expect further bearish move if you zoom into h1 time frame we have been stuck inside this range lately for the previous couple of days if broken upward expect a slight bullish movement to retest this resistance zone if broken downward expect as mentioned a break or a dive inside the 25k support you can zoom even lower i personally don't zoom lower than h1 but for example on m30 if this one is broken down expect a movement till here and then if the bulls take over here expect a movement to the upper bound but you've got the idea from h1 this is a range that we'll see which way it will be broken up or down to decide the next uh, movement to the resistance or to the support and you know what to do if the support or the resistance are broken upward and downward best of luck and i'll see you hopefully on the next one